Hi everyone. So today I am going to explain one more important topic in class six. That is landforms. See, we are all living on the Earth planet. Earth is a unique planet. No other planets as like as Earth because on the Earth there is a water is available, air is available. And next one, natural resources are there, and oxygen is available. So that is why all living things are living on the Earth planet. So on Earth, on the Earth, so landforms are not same. The landforms are not same. Means uneven, up and downs. See, on the Earth, landforms are not same. So the landforms are divided into three types of landforms are there on the. Earth. So, what are the three types of landforms? One is plateau, second one is plain areas, and third one is mountains. See, so these are the total land. But this land is not same. On the Earth, seventy-nine percent nearly covered with with its total water. The remaining twenty-one percent only land. This twenty-one percent land is not same, uneven means different types. So that the landforms be divided into three categories: one is plateaus, plains, and mountains. Okay. See, to measure the height of a land, we are seeing one important measurement that is MSP. MSP means Mean sea level, mean sea level, MSL, MSL, mean sea level. How it just now I told that Earth is a blue planet. Nearly seventy-nine percent of area covered with water. Only twenty-one percent land mass. So from the water body, we are calculating, we are measuring the height of the land. So that mean sea level from the sea. From the sea area to how many meters height that the land is there. So based on that we can decide. So that is the mountain or plateau or plain. Total landforms are on the earth is three types of landforms. One is plateaus, plains, and the mountains. So let us go to discuss one by one. First, I would like to tell you that is a mountain. See, mountain is you know very well. Naturally, uh, here mountain is naturally elevated from the surface to it will be very high from the sea. Mountain is it is very high from the sea level. So how many people have been born say because the at sea the surface is somewhat broad and when it's going to upwards, automatically the height will become so narrow. And down it becomes very broad. See this we can call as a mountain. So mountains are very high. Mountains are very high from the sea level. So this is one type of landform. Generally we can call that. Generally we can call that mountains are naturally elevated surface with some and broad base. Base will be broad. And uh, it will be very high from the sea. These mountains will be very high from the sea. So broad it will be. The down base is very broad, and when it's going to upwards automatically, the uh, it becomes very narrow. It, but it will, it will be very high from the sea level. For example, I am telling you, for example, the Himalayas. You know, Himalaya mountains are very high. It is like a chain system. We can call that um, Himalayas mountain chain. Okay. See Himalaya mountains. These mountains are one type of landform. Once again, so mountain is nothing but a mountain is naturally elevated surface with the summit and broad base, and also the height will be narrow. This we can call peak, peak of the mountains. So this is one type of landform. So we can call these are the mountains. 
So present we are living in Telangana. So Telangana it is in the plateau region. Telangana it is in the plateau area. We are living on the Dakkan plateau. Means from the sea level we are high. You just to see the Andhra Pradesh. Andhra Pradesh is in the like east Goa, west Goa in this area total plain area. Okay. So plain areas. The people are living in the plain areas. We are living in the plateau regions. Total on the capital. These are the main important types of food land forms are available. So remaining food is this in the next chapter.